Look up, look down, watch out, the tiger's on the town tonight. I'm a deadly handsome man. I'm the lion in the lamb. Madness, more madness. FAU making history, child, please. We saw the biggest Elite Eight blowout since 1992. I think that qualifies as madness. 30 years. The biggest Elite Eight blowout in 30 years. Gonzaga on the wrong side or not on the right. They're on the wrong side of that one. Yikes. Yikes. The madness continues. Two more today to set the final four. Let's do this. Sunday, fun day, $19.99. Pinned right here to the top of the comment section. And that is all we got today, baby. Penny here, GhostBigsATS.com, the number one sports consultant in the business, Sunday, March 26th. Again, Sunday, fun day, $19.99. You get all my picks for today right here, pinned right here to the top of the comment section. That is it. That is it, my friends. Simple promo today, simple day today. I got plays in both college basketball games. Then I got one NBA and I got one H NHL. And that's it. That's it. The boy went out last night. Feeling fresh. Feeling fresh. Feeling gravy. Okay, listen, that's it. Yesterday was like uh, uh, like a more break-even day again. I had a lot of break-even days like the, this week, this past, like Monday we started uh, started hot this week. I had a couple hot days and then look, like I've had a lot of break-even days, type days, break-even type days. Don't want to call it break-even days because then I'll get called out. Because some of them might be slightly above. Some of them might be, you know, slightly below. Um, um, but that's just the way our week has gone. At least the last few days anyway. Lost my top tier play uh, yesterday on the Kraken Preds under uh, six and a half. I had a winner on the Kings money line. Winner on UConn money line. Lost Kansas State money line. That was my top tier play in college basketball. The game actually did not pan out. It, 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 it did not exactly pan out the way I thought. I got it wrong. I got it wrong. FAU, Kansas State, it was a battle. It was a battle. And I by no means was sleeping on FAU. I know by no means thought Kansas State was going to just blow them out. Right? I was just on the wrong side, you know, and which happened very rarely here in this tournament. Uh, it was a bit back and forth, the game. It, it was definitely a battle. It was back and forth. Uh, Kansas was up. Kansas State was up. You know, they had their chances. You can't sleep on those boys from FAU. That There's no doubt about that. They showed up yet again as expected. They fought hard. They won. They punched their ticket to the Final Four. These kids are making freaking history. Put some respect on their name. And I lost the, the under here on YouTube. Again, I lost. I did. I lost the free play here on the under on YouTube. And for, for, for once, I feel like I just got one wrong. You know, this entire tournament, especially here, especially my free plays right here on YouTube, we have been smoking it. We have been smoking it. Today, we hit one for sure. We'll bounce it right back here on the YouTube. UConn got that win in college. Basketball, man, oh man, what a disaster for Gonzaga. What a disaster for Gonzaga. Lost my... uh. Free play on Venetius too. You know, that was like a coin flip fight. I called the wrong side. UFC went really well. Okay. I dropped my parlay though. Holly Holm, winner. Vergara, winner. Lutz was the loss on the parlay. And then you go to my fight picks on the on the main card. Winner on Sanhagen. Winner on Derev, uh, plus 148. Okay. And we had a winner on Parsons Giles over two and a half, which was plus 134. And I lost on Steven Peterson. I had a nice, I had nice plus money winners yesterday in the UFC. Shouts to everybody who jumped on my UFC, especially at that discounted price, because it's another nice, profitable UFC event. Another one. This week is UFC 287. It's going to be Izzy Pereira. It's going to be Burns and Masvidal. If you're not with me for the UFC. We continue to smack. We continue to smack. We continue to take money, put it in our pockets in the UFC. Let's do shout out of the day. Shout out of the day winners today. UConn and under 153 and a half. So our shout out of the day, Gavin Ferro, Kenneth Esquivel, Gloria K, 
Patrick Dunlap, David Tuck, and Brandon Taylor. I feel like I jinxed Chino332. Uh, again, if I miss your name, please let me know. Today, let's do our best pick of the day, right? Tell me your top bet for Sunday, and then we'll pick a winner for tomorrow for shout out of the day. We've been having fun playing the game where we guess the correct outcome. Today, we're going to do, we're going to uh, uh, um, uh, pick our best bet of the day today for Sunday. All right. Tell me your best winning bet of the day for Sunday in the comment section. Once MLB starts, okay, um, we're going to be doing some fun challenges in the MLB and stuff like that for shout out of the day. But for day for today, just tell me your favorite pick of the day for Sunday in the comment section. First game will be at 220 for the uh, 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 college basketball. So let's hit a free play. Number six, Creighton at number five, San Diego State. Free play of the day, San Diego State plus two and a half. I'm going to ride with the Aztecs. At, uh, 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 and I think at this point, just like in any major sport, right? When you get to the top, when everybody, when it's getting this close to the championship, right? And I like this goes, I think, a lot for NFL playoffs, AFC championship, NFC championship, NBA, when we're talking conference championships uh, and series and stuff like that, college football. You know, when it's getting this close, when we know the teams are good, we've seen them both play enough now. You know, we can make a case for both sides. I think it comes down a lot to preference, preferences, and I think it comes down to feel, okay, in a way. I mean, you look over the way that these two teams match up, for sure, obviously. You know, Creighton just handled business against Princeton. The Cinderella of the tournament went home. Shouts to Princeton, though, for real. But yeah, I mean, Creighton today... Is looking for its first Final Four in history, which I I didn't I didn't know that. I feel like it's something I I, I would know or should know, but I didn't know that. That's crazy to me. Creighton, I had the uh, I, I had Creighton going pretty far in my my one bracket, but that's the bracket that got busted way back, you know. So I didn't even look at it. But in watching Creighton, you know they they've been playing really well, better than expected, and uh, especially offensively, right? But I think they're gonna have a harder time shooting today against San Diego State. You look at Creighton against Baylor, offensively fire. They've been shooting the lights out. Same against Princeton. Okay, they've been hot. I don't know if it's going to be like that against San Diego State. San Diego State is getting two and a half points. I'm going to take the two and a half points. I'm going to take the plus two and a half points. Free play today, San Diego State plus two and a half. Then at 6 p.m., this is in case someone wants to come watch later. Okay, San, Di uh, San Antonio Spurs at the Boston Celtics. Free play today, Boston Celtics minus 16. We got some high numbers in the NBA today. We're seeing that regular season come to a close. I know it's a big number. I'm, I'm, I'm going to lay the big number with the Celtics at home. Free play today, Boston Celtics minus 16, and that'll do it Sunday, fun day, right here. Pinned right here at the top of the comment section. Plays in both college basketball games, one NBA, one NHL. That's going to do it. Let's have a good day. Look up, look down, watch out. The Tigers on the town tonight. I had the tappy toes going last night. I did look. I had the tappy toes going last night. I was, yeah, boy. Hot. Huh? Let's go. Let's have a good day. Hey, as always, good luck. God bless. Right on, baby. Cheers.